Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Eddie Marcus here, early this morning, as usual. I got a special request. There's something that I want to do, and I need your support. I would like to make every American, all of us, rich. I would like to make all of us rich. And when I say rich, I mean being able to do whatever it is that we want to do. I would like to be instrumental in causing that to happen. But I can't do it without your support. And the reason that I want to do it, ladies and gentlemen, is because I think I just have to realize and face the truth that I'm one of the greatest lovers in America. In fact, I'm one of the greatest lovers on earth. Now, why do I say that? I say that because of how I feel, my connection with human beings all over the earth when it comes down to those essentials that are so very important. I want for you the same thing that I want for me. I want joy in my life. I want fun in my life. I want responsibility and I want to be able to meet them joyously. Now, for some strange reason, I believe that every last one of us kind of feel the same way. But it's not just that I feel that I want that. I've been blessed, my friends. I can see it being done. I can see it being done. In other words, I'm not just talking about some stuff. I'm not just talking about some hope. It's like the architect when he wants to see a building and he says, wow, wah, 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 wah. Or wah, 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 wah. He sees it. When I talk about Every last one of you, ladies and gentlemen, living like you're rich, that means you're never worrying about food and clothing and shelter. And you're getting that just like you want it. I'm talking about you, every last one of you, those of you in Kentucky right now who are going through all the changes in Illinois, Arkansas, and all across the globe, never having to worry about, never having to worry about education, never having to worry about health care. And you know why? Because every last one of you got a career of your own choosing that gives you your greatest joy. And that great true power behind life itself has already designed it in such a way that when you exercise the gifts that you have been given, you will be at the same time creating in abundance food, clothing, shelter, education, health care, transportation, infrastructure, and all those other things that come through your imagination. That's what you will be doing my friends, and that is the way life is shaped. We came here to do what God has created us to do. And in so doing, we are to be blessed, living here as though we're in heaven, creating what God has designed us to do. Not selling out to someone who thinks they can do it better than God by putting money on the tab, by denying people food, clothing, shelter, education, health care, by killing people, turning them into slaves, lying, cheating, oh, hey, baby, I don't have to go any further. I'm asking you to join one of the greatest lovers on the face of the earth and make sure that every American lives as if they are a millionaire. Now, I got information on other videos that will indicate how this is to be achieved. There's no secret. I'm not hiding anything. I'm not trying to sneak anything. I'll tell you if I, if, if, if you had the time, I'd tell you right now. It's very simple. We're going to go back to the original plan. That's the original plan that I just shared with you. It is the original plan for humanity. It's the original plan for Russia, for China. It's the original plan for humanity to live on earth. And all of this crap that we got going on is people trying to be God, and their ultimate weapon is punishing you. You talk, well, I'm not going to go there. <laughs> I need your support, ladies and gentlemen. And I want to thank you so very much for giving me this your time. Now, how do I want 
you to support me right now. Right now, I'm sharing this information with you because I want to tap something inside of you to excite you. Right now, all I want you to do is to think about what I'm saying. I want you talking about a new future. I'm not talking about the stuff we've been going through all your life. No, I'm talking about wiping that slate clean. I'm not talking about what and no. No, I'm talking about cleaning it up, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. <clears throat> By forgiving yourselves to be born again into a new understanding about life. I don't think there's asking too much when you get what you want out of life because you're giving it all you got and it's all good. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, this is Eddie Marcus saying goodbye for now.